everyone welcome to Tuesday I've got some puppies <laughs> they're actually being very well behaved with just put my joggers on so this is a bit of crying but no barking Rosie's actually been a very good girl very very calm which is good what a good girl you're being because she used to get a little bit silly but I think the secret is for me to remain calm which I don't usually do but to my joggers on and then have a little bit of a break and then because obviously once I get the leaves that'll be it I am just going to drive down I feel pretty good but I've got groceries to get and I want to do a bit of weight training and things so I'm just going to do a short walk was, and then I can go in my shower and get organized for the groceries so I'm not going to get a lot achieved today Christy went off to her camp very excited so um, I hope she has a good time she's never skied before so it's certainly going to be a bit of an adventure for her so, and she has no idea what to expect so uh, I hope she has a good time I know when I first went down to the snow with friends first and I got to see people skiing and stuff so at least I sort of knew a bit more what to expect but she's got no idea so anyway I'm sure she'll have a good time and yeah I'll take these puppies out on their walk crazy dogs are finally in their halties I was just getting my keys and it's out of a bag that I haven't used for ages and look I found a little travel crystal nail file you know, I don't even remember this one. I had another one that I broke. I don't even remember that one. That is fantastic. Because <laughs> I really want one. I really need one to have in my bag. We could barely wait impatiently by the car door. You're a good boy. Crazy is the... Crazy, yeah, she is crazy. Rosie's the crazy one. <laughs> she wouldn't come. She's been really getting really silly. So I'm trying to really make sure she's sort of calm and not barking at me before I put a halty on. Which is what we did today. I turned away from her, actually. Oh my gosh, Rosie, what are you doing? <laughs> Crazies. Well, the waddle's past its best now. Still a bit of colour, but yeah, it's all gone. It must only be for a couple of weeks that it's sort of really out. Look, this one's almost gone totally. Probably can't see. You can see the difference between those two. Huh. Doesn't last very long. Some little spring flowers on here too. Aren't they cute? Love springtime. I just got overtaken by that guy and he's probably 20 years older than I am. It's a bit embarrassing. Could have been 30 years older than I am. <laughs> just shows my fitness levels not what it used to be. See the mountains way in the distance there? That's where we were. That's where we went over to get to Kangaroo Valley. Down the other side. And you know what? Kevin didn't even notice that I had done the garage. All he noticed was that I moved the little ladder that was there. <laughs> He's very observant. Actually Kevin's not observant. Even if I get a haircut he never notices so I don't know why I'm surprised. <laughs> And now it's time to do some weights. All done. Nice and sweaty and hot. And I'm sure I look just delightful. Anyway, this is the reality of me post-workout. Anyway, what's good? I'm just absolutely loving being able to do my weights again. Oh, so good. I've forgotten how much I absolutely love it. So, even I'm tired, I'm so happy. So I actually haven't been following a proper program as yet. Um, again, you guys have been around for a while. Well, now I'm a big fan of Valerie Waters and I'm a long-standing member of her Red Carpet Ready Club. Um, I mean, she does the most brilliant programs and I've got quite a collection now after, I think I joined her stuff in 2008. Yeah, end of 2008, I think it was, so a while ago now. And yeah, I've got quite the collection. So I've just been like taking one that's mainly a little upper body, using the free weights because that's what I enjoy the most. And then um, adding in some leg exercises that I know. And um, just to, probably doing the easiest stuff, as I said, a lot of free weights. I mean, I've got a band and stuff, they're upstairs, I've still got to bring them down. But just doing what I enjoy at the moment to get some strength back and just um, 
the one I just did, supposed to do three sets, I just did two sets of it. And I said, and I added in, I'm not doing any ab work at all at the moment. It's not worth my time. Plus, I've got a really sore back, so mind you, maybe the ab work would help with my back. <laughs> so maybe I should start to do that. Having said that out loud, yes, okay, next time I do it, I would try and do a little bit of ab work to see if that can help with my back. I am dripping, and it is winter, but anyway. Um, good and good. So I just thought that you know that's kind of what I'm doing. So just to continue to enjoy it and just to ease back into it. And then maybe um, in another couple of weeks, I might I'll probably do her bikini body program, which sounds a bit funny for me who never plans to wear a bikini, but it's probably like her beginner program. So I'll probably start doing that properly. And I think that's a six week program and then like going through that, although my favorite is Action Hero Baby because again, a lot more um, free weights in that, so that's my favorite. Um, definitely what I like doing. I've been throwing around the idea of joining the gym, but I'd have to be back into regular exercise and not having um, fibro flares. Luckily, the last one, what did it last? It four days? That's pretty short, I think. Um, I'm keeping a much better record now of things, so I can, I've got a an app what's it called I've got an app on my phone so I just um do I get a headache or an upset stomach or any of my um symptoms that I get the body pain it's called my pain diary I think it was I don't know if it was free or what now I can't remember but I can um pull up my history for the month I'll show you so yeah, you can pull out your history for the month and you can see there was this. I didn't actually add in, I think that's Sunday. No, that's the four days, okay? So that was yesterday, yep. So you can see there. I don't know why, I don't know why that one's in red. I did mark it with a star. That was my worst day. And you can see got lots of good days. And then this is when I started. So and I was still having a run of headaches at this stage. But hopefully, like that should really give a good view. Look, a lot more good days. I'm liking that. And again, the flare just lasted four days. The last flare, I had four days, one good day, but that's really over a week. Anyway, hopefully still a lot more good days than um, bad days. But I think that'll be a really good record. I should have been doing that for a long time. I had a different app and it just didn't work very well for me, but that one seems to be pretty easy to use and pretty good to fill in. 10 to 10, oh my gosh, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. I've just got a beautician's appointment this afternoon, so I get to relax this afternoon. That's okay. <laughs> and get the groceries. I'm just trying to remember my priorities are good food, healthy food, exercise, and obviously taking care and looking after myself. And then everything else comes after that. Problem with the house next, but the house is pretty good at the moment. I got a little bit done yesterday, so big hopefully i'm going to really get stuck into the decluttering over the next three days i hopefully can get my exercise done earlier i need to get done earlier i can't be starting the day at 10 30 or 11 o'clock <laughs> can't expect to get anything done and i was up early this morning too i was up at 3 30 but then went back to sleep i watched some cycling and oh fun cycling so relaxing i love it so much but it just um it can soothe me rest soothe me off to sleep or Whatever, I don't know, you know, guys know what I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. It can relax me enough that I just doze off. So I'll pause this TV and then come back to it. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, it's up early. Um, then obviously getting Christy off to camp and things like that. So, all right, I am, yeah, I need to cool down because I'll just have a shower and just drip everywhere again. Okay, so I'm going to try and eat my breakfast while I'm cooling down. So, it's just the banana overnight oats that I made yesterday. I was just doing a little bit of tidying up in the kitchen, putting some things into soak. And I was going to find a home for all the dog stuff. I can't remember if I vlogged this yesterday. My memory is so bad, as you guys know. Uh, Kevin went to pick up a few things. I gave him, I needed the heartworm chews and one of these for Rosie. That was all I needed. And apparently Kevin said, looked up our records and we needed all this. $470 worth. Yeah. What? And this one, oh, it's next year. So, <laughs> it's a bit naughty of them. Well, I didn't muck it up, but anyway. Yeah, well, that well, one was the one we already had. We had that and we had that. Anyway. <laughs> I need to buy it eventually, but still, it's a bit annoying having to spend it now. Anyway, this usually, there's a basket in the back of that cupboard, and that's where it usually is. But obviously, it's probably not all going to fit in anyway. And I'm sick of having to deal with that. And I have got doesn't really look like it but there's more space up there I can move things around so 
with my trying to streamline my kitchen a little bit it doesn't really look like it at the minute but I am going to pop it up there somewhere <laughs> oh sorry first of all, I'm gonna put a basket and then I'm gonna pop the basket up there and that would just be a little bit easier to find and dig out when we need it each month okay there we go I was originally going to put it in that white container but as you can see you can't really see into that white container and I thought I will lose it and never be able to find it so I'll put it in the clear one so I can see that that's what that is in there um, so hopefully I should remember <laughs> next month so I need to do more work in the pantry again I just did it a few weeks ago I don't know I need less stuff I've been saying that for ages and I am trying to work on having less stuff we're sort of kind of getting there but yeah anyway <laughs> I am I'm off to have my shower now yeah it's only 11 th oh my god no it's 10 30 so I lost an hour then <laughs> so I'm gonna go and have a quick shower since I'm having a facial this afternoon I'm not gonna bother with any makeup at all I'm just oh I was gonna wash my hair but it's so much point of having a facial so I'll just have a really quick shower uh, just to freshen up and not be quite so stinky as I sure as I sure as I'm sure I am Anyway, get my shower, finish up my grocery list and get out of here so I can get some groceries. Um, I'm not desperate, I probably could almost put it off to tomorrow, but I'd like to have tomorrow all free and then to try and get some things done. The other thing I've decided in relation to my exercise is on the days I'm good, I exercise because I never know what the next day is going to bring. I said last week I had four days where I couldn't exercise, so... Um, I didn't exercise Tuesday or Wednesday. I might have walked once, but I didn't do any weights. And I should have. So that's my new thing. Or if I can't do weights, I ride the exercise bike or I do some yoga. I do something. Every single day that I'm capable of doing it. I mean, you look at this blue sky now. We went, it was all overcast. Ah. Oh. Like I missed out now. Oh, just already. It's going to be so good to get some eyelashes and eyebrows today. <laughs> you see? Look, especially the eyelashes. Like... My eyebrows are not, you know, they're like half eyebrows. And eyelashes, I don't think I've really got any them. And they're there, but they're all blonde. So that'd be good to, um, I think it's all so different when I'm, they're gone. <laughs> anyway, good to get them back again. Typical. Rosie's having a little sunbake again. I think it's a nicer spot, doesn't she? Look at you, Bailey. You're too long for your bed. Too long. Are you too long? Are you a big boy? <laughs> You're a funny boy. Are you Rosie? You nice and warm? Oh, is she a little bit warm? You're a little bit warm. <laughs> to find something to put her... her um, Blankets, I don't we need them now, do you? Are you cute? <laughs> you cute with your little ears. You look cute. You look sleepy. All right, puppies, let's go downstairs. We're finished upstairs finally. So I've done a bit of a menu plan. Um, I haven't done the weekend, but I don't like two of these are leftovers from last week, <laughs> so. I always make dinner for those nights. I just can't think at the minute. So next step is just checking the pantry and seeing anything that we might be short of. Looks like most things are reasonable. Maybe some more savoury yeast flakes because I've been using more of those. I'm back from the grocery. Just put the fridge stuff away and some stuff in a thinner that you'll finish off for me. So now I have to decide what I want for lunch. I've got to leave in half an hour and I my stomach's gone mental again. Um, <laughs> As in hard and icky. So I have no idea what I want. Actually, I kind of know what I want is a sandwich with like a veggie burger or something. But we're ha having bread and soup for dinner. So I don't really want to have bread again. Um, I just don't know. I don't know if I've got time to really sit and eat a salad. I probably could manage it. But like I haven't got any fried onions. I haven't got any sweet potato. There's a... I kind of just want some vegetables and stuff, but my stomach. Uh, well, at least it only just started a little bit at the end of the groceries, and then um, that was all. Just what I want. I've got to eat something. 
Okay, so just to start to go, something really simple. So I've got some corn thinned with the hummus I made yesterday and some tomato with salt and pepper. Then when I come home, three o'clock, I'm gonna bake up some sweet potatoes and have some potato seed then. Well, I'm just heading off to the beautician's. That was a perfect little snack actually, it was quite filling. Um, <laughs> so I'm heading off now. When you see me again, I'll have some eyelashes and eyebrows and a very shiny face and very greasy hair. That's the problem with vlogging on a beautician day. But anyway, I didn't get the washing up done, unfortunately. Hopefully, Athena will do it. I'll ask her to do it for me. Okay, bye. I am back from my facial look. Eyebrows and eyelashes. And yeah, as I said, shiny face. Actually, this isn't too shiny, but I've got the greasy hair. And look behind me. Athena said she was going to do it while I was gone. That makes me sad. <laughs> Right. I'm going to go grab our dogs and I'm going to chop up some potatoes and get them in the oven and I'm going to make a cup of tea because I am freezing. Did I show the dog yet? It was really cold at the She must have been warm because she didn't put the air conditioning on, the heating on and it was cold. My feet are like ice. Oh, they're in a bucket of iced water. Not unusual for me, to be fair. And I usually wear socks. And for some reason today, I don't know why, I didn't wear socks. I don't know realize how cold it was outside. Same as this morning when I went for that walk, it was cold. Okay, so I've dealt with the washing by putting most of it in the dishwasher because I won't need much space tonight. Got potatoes in the oven and they're going to be another half an hour and I'm hungry. So I'm having, this is the refried bean and salsa mix, dip, and Mary's Gone Crackers, so pretty healthy snack. Cup of tea. And I'm going to go and sit down on the couch now until my potatoes are ready. I've still got some things to do with but I'll deal with them later on okay potatoes ready now so I'm just having some potato with this tomato chutney um and it worked out as you can see there's not much potato left worked out well because Athena was very grateful to have it because she wasn't feeling well she hadn't had lunch so she was really hungry so she's got a big bowl of potato now just you know I'm happy for her to have it. that's nice and nutritious for her this doggy, when I was chopping up the vegetables, he didn't even get up and come in the kitchen. Because, oh, did I, I don't know if I told you my dad took them on a walk as well. <laughs> He's absolutely shattered. So, he didn't even get up and come and look for some food because he's that hungry. All right, I'm going back to YouTube. Okay, I've had a nice time. Oh, I only got a few YouTube videos watch and then I've got, I don't know what else to do. Oh, I finished um, putting up one of my blog posts up. No, vlogs up, not a blog post. That would be good if I'd done a blog post. Actually, I think on the weekend, I sat and got all the photos into the, the posts ready to go, but I still got to add words and then put them up. Actually, what I want to try and do now is go and reply to some comments because I had been slack again. It was hard. When I get sick, it's just like nothing gets done. So for four days, pretty much i've got a few things done over the weekend as far as like videos and stuff but like everything else has come to a grinding halt i was lucky i actually kept up with my food i still kept eating really well over the weekend but i wasn't cooking are you vlogging daddy yeah just what? doing dinner i thought you were going to shame them to toasting bread no it's kind of cooked over toasting board? toasting the roll yeah to yeah that was naughty because they don't really got it him out of to a Chopping board. It's right there. Mm. Anyway, Athena and really, <laughs> really, yeah, yeah, Athena's it'll, green it'll, hair. It'll crack on the brown. <laughs> Bright green now. <laughs> you have to grab it. I haven't got any hands. Put your, fridge, put your drink down. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So they they're having soup. Don't flush everyone. Oh, As he adjusts his robe. <laughs> Uh, well, I probably put it in the dishwasher. Jeez. All right, let's get to. Fancy pack in the dishwasher. Anyway, I'm having a dinner disaster. I've been standing for five minutes and I can't decide what I want for dinner. And then I think I've decided, and then I decide, no, I don't want that. See well, I made a decision. <laughs> bit of a wee one. I said I wasn't feeling like that soup. Um, it was a bit spicy, and I just didn't feel like it. Tummy's a bit funny still. Um, don't take a roll. Big lot of the hummus that I made, some falafels, just squish underneath, and tomato. So that's a bit weird, a falafel burger or roll, but I'm sure it will taste nice. <laughs> Heading up to bed now. 
just um we try to watch a thing on apple tv go back to where it came from about refugees or and the boat people try and come to australia really good series but we had a lot of trouble we talked to the third episode and it kept on freezing up because it uses the internet to to get it but anyway i had to finish watching that later on it was kept on pausing so then we ended up watching mr robot i think it is that we're watching quite a, mm, a good show i think i don't know it's one of those weird ones you know a bit bit out there and go oh, it's a bit dark for me but i think it's kind of good um anyway heading to bed now i read probably not for very long since i was up at like at 3 30 this morning <laughs> but we'll see hopefully i'll have a good night's sleep and hopefully be a little bit more productive tomorrow so I'm not sure when I'll check in with you guys again, but I will see you next time. Bye.